Our next case, an 11-month-old wolf dog named Sophie, is adored by her owners. But as any dog whisperer viewer knows, love isn't always enough to produce a happy, balanced animal. Sit. Sit. <laughs> Growing up as a child, my mom did not allow us to have any pets. Easy. So as soon as I moved out into a place where I could have pets, yes, I got a dog immediately. <laughs> Sophie is my third wolf dog. As soon as we started leaving her alone, we'll be back later. that's when we noticed that Sophie was going to be a problem with chewing. She's pulled things off shelves, papers, She's taken the mouse from the computer. She's also gone through our VCR tapes and tore up a very good collection of tapes. You never know what Sophie might eat. <laughs> Everything went in her mouth. Because she really got that one. Sophie just wants to be with us, and she wants to be in the house. If we leave the door unlocked while she's out there, she has figured out how to open it and get in by herself. <laughs> she would take running leaps at the sliding glass door. I mean, running leaps. And the bigger she got, that became a problem because we were afraid she was going to break the door down. So we wanted to cage her in the house. And what happened was the dog decided she didn't like being in a cage. First time we left her alone in the cage, she chewed the plastic bottom up and got down to the carpet, and Sophie chewed a huge hole in the carpet. After we patched it up, she chewed up that patch, tore it up, and made the hole bigger. So we had to put another patch on it. So we said, OK, well, we'll move the cage to another room where the there's laminate floor. She ate through here and then started lifting this up like this. So she bent the cage all up trying to get out and the, moved the cage all over the room. So then we said, we will chain her up outside with a collar. She slipped out of the collar and she got out of the yard. Sophie was actually in the dog catcher truck when we found her. So we bought a chain link dog pen, and the first time we left her alone, she actually chewed through the pen. She made a hole, squeezed her way out. I mean, she even cut herself getting out. She had to get out so bad. Trying to get out from that fence, she will make herself bleed. OK, let's go. After Sophie repeatedly injured herself in the pen, the frustrated couple decided to electrify the fence. Let's go. Come on. And once we had gotten that pen electrified, she would sit in the middle of that pen, not wanting to touch it anymore. She will just sit there in the middle, just sit there. And that's pretty much the condition you find her in when you get back to let her out. I think it's a form of separation anxiety. I think that she likes to be wherever we are. We're concerned only because when we leave, what happens? If she tries to get through the glass door and actually does that someday, obviously she's going to get very hurt. If she ever does get out of the yard again, I'm afraid she'll get run over and, you know, if she go to the pound, I, you know, yeah. I got this dog for the outside, mm -hmm. and she refuses to stay outside. Is she wolf mix? Yes, she's hybrid. Yeah, right? she's supposedly 60% timber wolf. 60%. To me, she behaves very much like a dog. Mm -hmm. You know, this is the first one that just came and pretty much is around everybody, very mm -hmm. calm inside the house. I don't really believe she's 60%. Really? I think okay. she's got a lot of the shepherd in her, actually. Okay. Her behavior told me that she was a little bit more dog like. She was coming up asking for social interactions, which is very much unlike what a wolf would do. The wolf is there, but it's definitely not 60%. So what do you guys do uh, for exercise? I take her for a walk for 45 minutes to an hour every night when I get home from work. Mm -hmm. If it's separation anxiety the problem, or if it's destructive behavior the problem, I believe that a tired dog destroys less. This is what we're going to do with your energy. See, Redirective. Right. Because anxiety can come not just from lack of exercise. Anxiety can come from lack of direction. Just tell them what you want, be clear with it, and follow through. Okay. Still to come, helping Sophie find balance. <laughs>